So do you want to see something really disgusting? You want to lay with daddy? Thank you. Oh. Wow! <laughs> That's okay. Yay! Yeah. Hey, what's up? Hi, how's it going? Yeah. I'm with this guy. And this guy. There's a Waskow bakery, deli type little shop inside the BX here on Ramstein. So we're getting something to eat really quick. And then we're going to go and let Calvin play for a little while. We initially came on base because okay, Travis needed body wash. Yeah. And we don't want Travis to be smelly. Calvin! Quit karate chopping people. Remember, you can't you can't be rough like you are with daddy. Remember? You and daddy play really rough. I don't want to play with me. I have no one to play with me. There's like a thousand and a half people in here. You could find someone to play with. You itchy? <laughs> you just grunted at me. <laughs> Here, I help you. I help you. I help you. I scratch you. Oh, is that better? There you go. Here, here's inside out. You look silly. You wanna go outside? You wanna go outside? Travis is out front adding those bricks to beside our yard because people keep running over our yard still. And I'm going to attempt to give Calvin a haircut. He's supposed to be taking a nap right now, but he's fighting it for some reason. And um, I do need to give him a haircut because haircuts here are about $6 more than they were in Okinawa, which means for Travis and Calvin to both get their haircut, it's over $30 here, which is insane to me because Travis requires a haircut like every 10 days to two weeks um, because he likes his hair really short on the bottom and they never do it the way he wants it done. So my hope is to learn to do it on Calvin so eventually I can do it for Travis so we don't have to pay to get his hair cut anymore. This would make things a lot easier, I think. Ah, I just tried to plug that into there. I'm so dumb. 120 volts, of course. That's so loud. Yeah. Let's see what daddy thinks. You're gonna put some boots on? Yeah, some Daddy's gonna say I did terrible, I bet. His head is so bumpy. That looks really good. You can see how high you can go up. Yeah, yes, I noticed that. So daddy says just fade this area a little bit more, which I didn't know like how far to go up here because I didn't want to mess up his long and his weird calic right here. So I think we'll try to fade this a little bit more and then be good. The rest of it looks pretty all right, yeah? There, does that look better? Does that look more faded? Let's see. Friends, does this look better? Yeah, let's go ask Daddy. What me look? You like it? Yes. Yes. That what do you think? Better. So call me a bad dog mom or whatever. But since we got here, I have not come outside to pick up Zeke's poop once. Because in Okinawa, it would disappear in like, I don't know, three days or something. It would rain and it would just disappear. And all the bugs, I don't know. But it was gone really fast. That didn't seem to be happening here. Every time Calvin would come out to play, he would come back with poop on his boots. And I'm like, okay, this has gotta stop. I don't really want to like walk in the yard though, because a lot of the yard right now is just moss. So it's just, it's just really wet. There's just a lot of wetness in the yard right now. But I just dedicated like the last hour to picking up all of Zeke's poop. So now the entire yard is poop free. 
So do you want to see something really disgusting? Both of these bags are full of poop. Not only that, I'm going to weigh it because they're really heavy. 12 pounds and 15 pounds. That's almost 30 pounds of poop, Ziggy. That's a lot of poop. Guess how much? A realistic guess. That's not realistic. Almost 30 pounds. Oh, <laughs> Were you being serious? Yeah, I didn't think it weighed that much. Yeah, there's a lot of poop. If your bottom nails are too long, I'll... You don't chew them with your mouth. I did. You're gross. I don't think they, they taste nasty. Your feet are all sweaty and germy. Well, we did just get out of the shower, but oh, still. High five. Next time ask us to cut them, okay? Come let me in the front door in a minute. That's really gross though, sorry. Not advertiser friendly, probably. We'll see how long our um, yard bricks last. Someone's probably gonna run it over. <laughs> but they were getting so far up into the yard. They were driving all the way up here. I was showing our friends what daddy did. I had to make a special point to show that I did actually wash my hands before I'm gonna start making dinner because some people might think I'm gross. I mean, I kind of am, whatever. I don't want to offend you by this, but I want to tell you something. You always smile when I say stuff like that. <laughs> I think it's time for new long johns. We looked for some. We have chicken with mushrooms, peas with seasoning salt, and baked beans with bacon. Thank Yum. You. I love that we have this huge table and sit at the coffee table. I'm literally just gonna say that. Exactly. Food. And I'm gonna eat with a spoon. Don't ask me why. Also, got my lemonade again. If I don't put these in the sink now, I will hate myself in the morning. Especially this pan. We are actually about to head to bed now. It's almost 10 o'clock. It's 9.45. But this kitchen is pretty much a disaster already. It seems like it gets so messy so fast. But we hope you guys enjoyed today's video, even though it was kind of gross. <laughs> I'm kind of gross. I'm kind of weird. I like weird things. I do weird things. Whatever. I'm surprised you guys are here. And I cannot believe we're 700 subscribers. We just hit 500 on the first of the month. We're already at 200. That's so crazy to me. It blows my mind. It's crazy that people stick around because I think I'm weird. No one else thinks I'm weird. I think I'm really weird. If you don't though, it's great. I'm glad you like us. I'm glad you like me for whatever reason. But if you enjoyed today's super gross video, please, please, please give it a thumbs up for us and hit subscribe. But for now, that is that. And we'll see you when we'll see you. Bye. Come on.